Edinburgh University offers more than 240 different societies, but only one dare to steal millions. No one noticed. They stole almost 1.5 million pounds and no one noticed. It's very easy to miss them. They weave their way right past us. I mean, most people who first hear about this society think, they think it's a joke. And yet, they managed to pull off the greatest money fraud operation this department has ever encountered. The scheme worked by taking money from members at the start of the year to invest in Harris Tweed, then using word of mouth to expand the pile, meanwhile rewarding the initial investors. They would then keep the money, claiming that the Tweed factory shut down. The factory shut down in 1945. But by the time anybody had figured this out, they managed to pull the wool over the eyes of dozens of vulnerable students. Dozens! When I realised that the society was founded on a tapestry of lies, it was too late. I tried to get out and tell someone about what was going on, but Nitsok wouldn't let me get away. I started to notice them following me everywhere I went. They weren't afraid to get their hands dirty. Also, I think I've developed some kind of wool allergy. Nitsok members are very much pack animals. Their movements are erratic and hard to track. We've repeatedly tried to determine their motivations and have come up short. It's possible that they've simply used the money to buy more alpaca yarn. If you're lucky, you can find them in the quiet corners of Tevian. They spend their free time knitting together in small social circles. Only a select few are allowed on the inside. They were completely under the radar for so long because nobody expected that these tranquil people were capable of something so criminally ingenious. And the extent of the scam was really much greater than anyone could have imagined. The misuse of society power by Nitsok is disgusting, and if Yusa had known about them earlier, we surely would have done something sooner. I mean, seriously, who even knits these days? Did you invest in the Harris Creed yourself? Uh, no, of course not. That would be unethical. Um, the, this, this scarf is a gift. It has nothing to do with the scheme. That's it, uh, this press conference is finished, thank you. Nitsock, the Yarn Conspiracy.